Grace and peace to you from the Lord Jesus Christ. Welcome again to this channel. And today's devotional will be Mark chapter 1 verse 40. The leopard. Um, this one is about Jesus heals a man with leprosy. So this man had leprosy. There's no history about him in his past. But. He has leprosy and he still wanted to go see Jesus Christ walking down the hall, uh, on the on the corridor and he saw him and he went over there. He begged and pleaded with him, Lord, please heal me if you will. And with his pity, he pitied him. And Jesus Christ turned around and says, I will be cleaned. And as soon as he said that, all his leprosy went away. And Jesus said to him, don't go yet. Spread the news. Go to the straight to the temple. Don't say anything what happened. Go straight to the temple. Tell them what happened. Give them an offering what the law of Moses requires. And then live your life. Just go away. And honor me, precious me. That's it. But instead, he went out there and he said, instead, he went out and began to talk freely, spreading the news. As a result, Jesus could no longer enter a town openly, but stayed outside in lonely places. Yet people still came to him from everywhere for me that is a that's evangelizing that's for me like evangelizing you're you're talking to them and telling them look at what the lord jesus christ he healed me i am yet i am better now i am clean and he's telling everyone this i believe in god thank you god Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus Christ, my Lord. He's telling everyone. Instead of going to the temple, he went and preached. He went out there and preached. He started saying, Jesus Christ healed me. He was repented by all his sins. And he went out there and he believed in God. He believed in Jesus Christ. So, I think this is a very important lesson out there that most people would not never understand how simple the Bible is, but pray for them. Pray for them to give repentance. Repent. Come to Jesus Christ and He will save you for all sins. Because the second time, uh, like the first time he came here, he came for salvation. The second time he will come back, he's coming here for judgment. So I tell everyone this, repent, come to Jesus Christ, and give yourself to God. I'll leave you with that, and may the glory of our Glory, glory and grace and love and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with us all. All right? Amen.